Hey guys, AJ here, back with another one. So today we are going to take at a clip from a show called The Real. Now The Real is the black version of The View. So right when you think that The View couldn't get worse, they have The Real. And just like The View, a bunch of middle-aged, old, bitter women all mad and whining about men. But before we jump into this clip, guys, please remember to like, subscribe, drop a comment. I appreciate all of your support. So basically, Delaware passed a law that's basically temporary. And it's saying that child support will now be received on basically what is a debit card. And uh, this debit card, it limits what these mothers can spend the child support money on it limits you to only things that are beneficial to the child and of course you would think from a logical standpoint that that's a great idea but no of course the women are all mad upset and let's just see with what these geniuses at the real have to say let's get into it the state of delaware is experimenting with a new type of child support in a form of a card which works much like an EBT card. Okay. The child support card will prohibit parents from paying for certain items like gas, rent, and adult clothing. Look at their faces. Do you see how their faces changed once they heard that? You can't spend child support money on your rent? Come on, man. They're upset already. And liquor. And liquor. <laughs> and no alcohol either. Bonnie, hmm. What do you think? What are you thinking? Is this a good idea? Well, I mean, you know what? Okay, this is the thing. You ever notice how the fattest, ugliest one is all always the loudest one? That I know about child support. Okay. Like, you know, child support goes to the one that's the major caregiver. Mm -hmm. And um, I think it's good that they do have the card yeah. and have certain restrictions. But I also want to... And they say everything before but is BS. I say that if you are the parent, and you, you're a parent, if you have a child 24-7, there's nothing wrong if it's your day off to take $50 and go have a meal. I think that that... So, do you see that? She said there's nothing wrong with taking $50 out of money that's supposed to go to your kids and spending it on a meal for yourself. That's crazy. That's true. Okay. And this crowd is, uh, is clapping for this. That is taking advantage of it. Send the asteroid. What? The, just, just blast us all. All the king, kingdom come. This whole world has just gone nuts. Man, because you know, come on. Some people they're not paying a lot of chi in child support. They, what is you that? Know what I mean, it's like they trying to act like you know they pay fifteen hundred, two thousand. Some are, but I'm talking about where I'm from. You know the D. <laughs> that three hundred a week is. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Three hundred yeah. a week. That, but, and, into action and this is why just guys i don't even listen to anything that women like this have have to say and that on the left that's one of the spice girls man life life done beat her up bad because, sadly you guys there are those ladies there out are there. a lot more people that are taking advantage of child support facts and that's why they put this into action that's why they're coming up with this idea because you can't take your girlfriends out for drinks on your child support. You can't. No, no. See, someone has some sense. And then water, watch the big one chime in with some foolishness again. Well, that's true. You but can't also, strip club I think using there, a card. It becomes a time when you, as the parent, you have rights, especially if you're paying child support, you have visitation. Why don't we start talking to each other as parents and as aunties and uncles about, hey, where is this money I going think, to? Absolutely. I think it depends on the person and the type of situation because mm -hmm. there are women out there, yes. this is the real, Their fathers who too. search for the dudes that have the money and say, you know what? Well, that's I'm a gonna... whole different level. That's child yes. support on but a whole no, different level. But, you know, but, but women do do that. Absolutely. Yes. They say they take advantage of, of the situation. But I think when you look at a bill of a mother who's charging things, uh, using so child support money, moms also deserve to... <laughs> to be, be able to take care of themselves and to be able to spend on themselves like there you go see moms deserve to use your money that you're giving her for your, your kids on themselves and she's serious if a mom is going to the gym she needs to get a workout in and she needs to feel good about herself if a mom is going to go 
get a drink with child support money? She should get that drink. It's what really happy. I don't know I don't about think... getting a drink on child support I, money. I'm sorry. I think if you're a mother, you absolutely deserve a nice little drink at happy hour. What is foolishness, guys? This is real. They're not joking. No, I don't want to hear what Mel B has to say. But guys, you see this. You see that the state of Delaware obviously changed this law because there was some type of identification of a need of that child support was not being spent on the kids, right? So as a measure to fix that, they're saying, look, we are going to limit what you can use child support for. And this is the foolishness. These women say, oh, well, I deserve to be able to use this child support money any way that I see fit to go out and have beers and pop bottles and get drunk. Please, guys, let me, let me know what you think. Let me know if you've been dealing with any foolishness with your ex and child support because I would love to hear your stories. And yeah, guys, this is all I got. This is AJ. I'm out of here.